going to pull some cards and see how is Biden's meeting going to go with Putin? How will the meeting go with Putin? How will Biden's meeting go with Putin? Water. How will Biden's meeting go with Putin? How will Biden's meeting go with Putin? Maybe a little better than expected. Let's see. Let's see what we've got. How will Biden's meeting go with Putin? Wish. Wish. Well, maybe he's hoping that he's going to have good luck with it. Because underneath of it, we've got the wish. The wish that it's going to flow and be okay. That's what he's hoping. It looks like we're getting, you know, prior to... But let's see what the other cards have to say. Okay, let's see what's known. A bit tied up. A bit tied up with things. What's known and things are a bit tied up. I think it's just that he's got to move carefully with this. Okay. Um, going into it. It's with an aim of moving things forward, looking, looking forward. That's the challenge, moving things forward. And, um, okay. It's, it's going to behoove him to, to be the leader, okay, to be a leader in charge and uh, as the head of our government. And so what I'm getting with it, he's hoping it goes well. He hopes he can make it flow, but he knows, again, he's kind of on a tightrope. He's kind of constricted, you know. And I think also he knows he wants to, you know, that, that things, again, that Putin's looking at going into, what is it, Ukraine, okay? And so... The challenge is to to bring that energy forward to to and to hold a, a strong line. Okay, Biden's going in and he's going to hold a strong line, but he knows he's a little bit constricted, um, and he he needs to tread carefully because Putin is you know setting up to invade Ukraine. So he's hoping and wishing that this goes well. Okay. Let's look at things on Putin's side. What is up with Putin? What's up? What can you tell me about Putin? What's up with Putin now? What's up with Putin? Hero. Uh, hero. Okay. Hmm. No ego there. I'm going to be the hero. I'm the one that's going to go in. I'm going to invade Ukraine. I'm going to bring them back to Russia. Okay. Tough, tough time. So, okay. Yeah. So a lot of, uh, he's thinking about invading. Okay. Joy, yeah. Okay, what he knows. Let's see what he knows. What's known. Let's see what's known. Let's 
So what's known is he's looking at the past, okay? He's caught up in the past, and he wants to, again, bring all these elements back to Russia to make Russia like it was. And he's on that projection, okay? The challenge is, yeah, to move this forward, to complete his world and put an end to this part. Okay. What could be beneficial? We need some justice. We need some justice. Okay, there needs to be some justice. Now, I think in his mind, he thinks he's justified in what he's doing. I want to bring Russia back to what Russia was, okay? And this is his goal. It doesn't matter who he hurts in the process. I'll crucify all of them if I have to. Uh, but I'm going to be the hero. I'm going to be happy because I'm going to fulfill my purpose of bringing Russia back. Okay? And uh, put an end to this. And he thinks he's justified in doing it. Okay? Mm. Yeah, hard times. Yeah, hero. He's, he's full of himself. I'm going to do this. I'm going to be the man. I'm going to restore Russia. Okay, I'm going to restore Russia. And so Biden is going into this, you know, hoping against hopes that he can move something forward. But it looks like Putin is just dead set on this. Okay, he is dead set on this. So let's look and see. So what is going to happen with the people of Ukraine? Let's look at this. Pull one more set. What about the people of Ukraine? This is just it. What about the people of Ukraine? Light at the end of a tunnel. Okay. Never had that card come up before. Light at the end of the tunnel. Okay, what about the people of Ukraine going through this? What about the people of Ukraine? Hoping for the best. They're hoping for the best. And this is a difficult time, but they're hoping they come through it. I think we have a lot of people on the hope with list here. Kindreds, okay. Banding together, okay. Banding together, hoping for the best. They see a dark time ahead, but they're hoping that it gets better. Okay, what they know what they know. Future. What they know is looking towards the future. Future. What are the actions that's going to take them to the future? Challenge is justice. The challenge is getting justice. And uh, what would benefit if somebody can come to long-term aid if there is someone that can come to long-term benefit for them, okay? So they're hoping for intervention. <clears throat> we have the same cards we have for Pudi, you know, justice. We need some justice. They're hoping that there's light at the end, that, that somebody, kindred spirits, others out there are going to help to defend them and bring them into long-term future, okay? Perhaps... They're looking to the U.S. They're looking to NATO. They're hoping somebody is going to help them, okay, through this time. So, Pudi wants to invade. He wants to take it over. He wants to bring Russia back. Biden is hoping for the best, hoping that he can change him and sway him and say, look, uh, U.S. and we're strong and we're going to, you know, 
and Ukrainians are hoping for the best light at the end of the tunnel. This is a dark time. We're hoping we get through it. We're hoping there are kindred spirits out there that are going to step up to the plate and help us. Okay? So we see it from the three sides. Putin is dead set on invading and taking it over again from Russia. This has been his plan from the beginning. He wants to restore Russia to its former greatness. Biden, you know, sees that things are really kind of, you know, tied up. And he's hoping for the best, hoping that, you know, he can talk some sense into him. Because Putin feels justified in what he's doing. I just want to restore Russia. And the Ukrainians are saying somebody will ha hope there's light at the end of the tunnel that somebody's going to step up and help us. Okay? Um, so we're going to have to wait and see and then read some more on this a little later. So, um, love and light. You know, we'll keep monitoring this and see what happens.